Hello Taurus and welcome back to my channel and this is your September reading from Anything Spiritual. The cards are jumping out already and your first card out is the Seven of Wands. And you can see this person working quite hard here, getting things in order. And it's like, as you sort one thing out, another thing needs to be sorted out. So there you are, working hard with the Seven of Wands. This could be um, a work, a job. This could be something you're creating. This could be if you're self-employed. This could be some sort of hobby. You're just trying to get things in order. Sevens can also be about a new approach. So it could be that... You having to look at a new way of doing things just to organise it a bit better or or even it could be to do with another person. We've got the King of Swords out here. Now this Swords is Air Energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. It could be that your work or creativity or something is um, affecting a man or perhaps you or a partner or you and somebody else are having issues where your work-life balance isn't quite meeting up so you're having to change to fit together if you like so Taurus let's pull a few more cards and see what's going on with you that king of swords energy that's quite a strong character that could be someone linked to law government you could take advice from them, but they can be quite um, ruthless if they really wanted to be. But there's new money coming in here. There's new starts for you. Are you joining forces with someone to bring in some new money? We've got you looking for a new approach. We've got this King of Swords energy coming in, this person you could take advice from. We've got new money. Taurus. Are you teaming up with somebody to bring new money in? The Six of Swords, that shows changes, that shows leaving old ways, ways that didn't serve you, ways that didn't suit you. So it definitely looks like you're changing something to bring in more stability, perhaps bring in more abundance. Perhaps this person you're taking advice from you know, these are general readings and they'll resonate with people differently. Some of you may be going to a lawyer or somebody like that for advice regarding money. Needing to bring in a balance, needing to bring in something, needing to change some ways. But there's something that needs changing. There's something where you need a new approach. Something that doesn't seem to be working because you're just battling against it. So you're going to speak to somebody for advice. You're going to team up with somebody else for a bit of support. And they're going to bring in this Ace of Pentacles for you. And then there's going to be no more struggling. In fact, there's going to be stability. So wow, Taurus, you stepping up, you getting somebody to back your corner, you getting some extra support will bring you a whole new start. The journey, the full card, look at him, taking a leap of faith, moving forward. Perhaps you're investing in something. Perhaps this could be some sort of finance person. But you seem to be teaming up with someone, Taurus, to help you to completely change the tower card. The tower card comes along and that's big changes. That could be moving. That could be changing jobs. That's when your foundations are rock. So whatever it is you're planning to do in September, where well, you could be taking advice, teaming up with someone, getting this support, somebody who will come in and be your strength and make these changes, but changes for the better. Not a lot of people like the power card, the tower card, but look what it's with, the full card, the four of one stability, new journey. Foundations need rocking, things need stirring up, things need changing because you're just struggling against it here. As you stand one thing up, another one goes. It's one thing after another, but that is changing soon. And wow, look, when this happens, when you take this brave step, 
to bring in this person, team up with someone. Well, this is sort of sensational for you, Taurus, because look what you're doing, okay? Someone's going to financially help you. And when they do, it's changing your world. You, it's like a whole new start. And look at that, the Seven of Cups. Opportunities, again, things coming out. You, you're going to have all these choices and opportunities that you don't have at the minute. So this is really positive. This person, this someone helping you financially, teaming up with you, supporting you, whatever it is they're doing, their ideas, their support is going to bring in new things. It's going to rock your world and it's going to give you so much opportunity. So it sounds like it's really worth doing. Perhaps you're thinking about it now. Ha <laughs> ha. Now, here I am battling away. Obviously, we're August at the minute. This is September. Here you are, picking up one thing, doing another, blah, blah. And perhaps you're thinking now, well, what if I took some advice or what if I did this or what if, you know, I went to a lawyer or, you know, what if I teamed up with somebody and perhaps, perhaps somebody will recommend someone and say, well, I've got a friend that knows all about that. However it comes about, Taurus, You'll be leaving the struggle behind. You'll be going to stability. Yes, it perhaps means making big changes, but look at the opportunities it brings you. Look at the money, the Ace of Pentacles. Let's have a look what your guardian angels have to say to you. So a lovely read. And again, a card just jumps straight out there. Fair Decisions. So your guardian angels, Taurus, are saying to you, your angels are aware that you have concerns, but be assured that there's nothing to worry about. Stand your ground and know heaven is shining its divine light upon the situation and all is being healed. Take time to review the details thoroughly. Forgiveness will bring peace to everyone involved. Well, this is you standing your ground. Nobody messes with the king of swords. Like I say, he can be ruthless. So this is you being really strong, standing in your power, standing your ground. Or again, like we say, it's you getting someone in to help you do that. But whatever ways, however you stand your ground, whether you, you do it yourself or whether you have somebody helping you, heaven is aware, your angels are aware that you're concerned and shining its divine light upon you. Make sure you review everything thoroughly. And when it talks about forgiveness, you know, if you're moving away from a particular person or a situation, just means you have to forgive that, not take that pain and hurt with you. Doesn't mean you have to still have those people in your lives, you can still move away, but it just means that you don't carry all that baggage with you. You say, you know, I accept this has happened, let's forgive this situation, just leave it behind. I can't have you in my life or I can't have that situation in my life anymore, but I'm not going to think badly of it. I'm going to accept that it happened and I'll forgive it and send love and light to it and then move forward without carrying that baggage with you. So lovely Taurus. It looks a lovely reading because whatever situation you're in at the minute that's pulling you down, making you feel a bit tired, pulling on your energy, you're going to find ways to be stronger, find ways to overcome it, find ways to make those changes, to bring in the stability. But it certainly looks like more money or abundance, good things, opportunities are coming to you. Enjoy Taurus. Thank you for watching and that's your September reading.